Welcome. What I want to do is show you how to solve a one-step equation. And when solving one-step equations, it's very important for us to understand that when solving an equation, we need to solve for our variable. So we have our variable a, and this, what this equation states is a minus 7 equals negative 3. And it's very common for students just to try to do these in your head. You know, what number minus 7 is going to equal negative 3? And a lot of times you can do that in your head. But I really want you to get used to using your inverse operations as practice because once we get onto two-step equations and multi-step equations, a lot of these problems get very difficult to do in your head. So what we're going to do is we're just going to practice using our inverse operations. So to solve for a variable, a lot of you are very um, used to using your order of operations when simplifying an expression. Well, what we're going to do is we're going to use the reverse order of operation, meaning I'm going to use my inverse operations in the reverse order that I would for the order of operations. So what we want to do is we want to isolate that variable A. And to do that, we want to undo everything that's being happened to the variable. So I look at the variable, and I notice that my variable is being subtracted by 7. So to undo that, I'm going to have to add 7. So when by adding 7, you'll notice that negative 7 plus 7 is going to give you 0. So now I'm going to have a plus 0 on my left side. But with an equation, it's important that an equation is a, is a statement of equality, meaning the left side has to equal the right side. So I'm going to have to make sure I add a 7 to the right side. Therefore, negative 3 plus 7 equals 4. Now, in the statement, I have a plus 0 equals 4, where I can simply just say a is equal to 4. So, to just double check my answer to make sure what I did is correct, what you can always do is plug in the value of a that you solve for and plug it back into the original equation. So, 4 minus 7 equals negative 3. By checking our answer, by simplifying this left side, we do indeed see that my answer for a equals 4 is correct. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That's how you solve a one-step equation. Thanks.